Hello there. A brief ridge of high pressure has brought some spring sunshine for many of us today. You can see on the satellite that cloud has cleared towards the southeast. A little bit more in the way of cloud across the northwest of Scotland. There's still some sunny spells here, just the chance of one or two showers, uh, but they will tend to peach out as we go through this afternoon. Plenty of dry, bright weather across much of Northern Ireland, England and Wales, although a bit more in the way of high level cloud moving in from the west through this afternoon, perhaps turning the sunshine hazy. Temperatures at a maximum of 13 degrees Celsius as we go through this evening and overnight then we'll see the cloud increasing from the west bring some outbreaks of rain for northern ireland into western parts of scotland though much of central and eastern parts of england staying dry with some clear spells and the coolest temperatures will be in the east where we see those clearer skies so tomorrow some cloud for north and western parts. There will be some outbreaks of rain, perhaps falling something a bit wintry over high ground in Scotland, a few showers following on behind in Northern Ireland, but I think for central and eastern England, a lot of dry, bright weather, and we could even see highs of seven. Thank you very much. A brief ridge of high pressure bringing many of us some spring sunshine today. As we move through this afternoon, continuing to see some, sh uh, some sunshine across much of England and Wales, Northern Ireland. A little bit more in the way of cloud across northwest Scotland, perhaps, but still some good spells of sunshine. Perhaps one or two showers in the northwest of Scotland and turning a little bit hazy that sunshine in western areas. Temperatures at a maximum of 13 degrees Celsius as we go through this evening and overnight. We continue to see the cloud increasing in the west, some outbreaks of rain moving into Northern Ireland and then into western parts of Scotland, perhaps western parts of Wales as well. But over to the, to the south and east, more in the way of dry weather, and there will be a few clear spells in eastern parts. Now tomorrow, a bit of a cloudier day with some outbreaks of rain in the north and west. That rain could fall as snow over high ground for a time in Scotland, drier over in the east. Some outbreaks of rain to begin with uh, for Northern Ireland. Behind it, starting to see some sunny spells and showers. A largely dry and bright day, though, for much of central and eastern England, but starting to see some outbreaks of rain later in the day in the west. Lucy Martin. Lucy. Thank you very much. A chilly start to the day today, but we have seen plenty of spring sunshine. Our weather watchers have been out taking photos and sending in the weather near them. This photo sent in by a weather watcher in Kingston earlier. A few little wispy clouds, but lots in the way of blue sky. And similarly, plenty of blue sky here in Keswick, sent in by our weather watcher, Matty. Now, this brief ridge of high pressure settling things down does look like it's going to be short-lived. We've got our next area of cloud waiting in the wings, and that's going to gradually work its way in as we move through this evening and into tomorrow. So a lot of dry, bright weather as we move through this afternoon, holding on to plenty of sunshine. The sunshine perhaps turning a bit hazy in the west, thanks to some high level cloud. And there is just the risk of one or two showers in the north and west of Scotland. Temperatures at a maximum of 13 degrees Celsius, a touch down on what we saw in the south yesterday, but still feeling pleasant in the sunshine with light winds. As we go through this evening and overnight then, that area of low pressure pushes in from the west. It will bring outbreaks of ra rain and more in the way of cloud. The wind picking up as well. So through tonight, outbreaks of rain spreading into Northern Ireland, later into western parts of Scotland and perhaps into the far west of Wales. Over in the east, it will be drier with some clear spells. The rain perhaps falling as snow for a time over the high ground in Scotland. Temperatures in the east uh, slightly cooler where we've got the clear skies. Over in the west, though, overnight lows between 3 and 7 degrees Celsius. So tomorrow, a cloudy day without breaks of rain in the north and west. Again, that rain could fall as snow for a time over the hills in Scotland. Drier in the east. The rain working its way east across Scotland, behind it starting to stick, sorry, across Northern Ireland, behind it, a mixture of sunny spells and showers. A largely dry and bright day for much of central and eastern England, though, and with any with plenty of sunshine around, we could see highs of around 17 degrees Celsius. Holding on to that milder air in the southeast as we move into Saturday, some uncertainty in the forecast, though, as to the exact positioning of this rain coming up from the south. If it does go to the west, like we expect it will do at the moment, we could see the temperatures in the southeast reaching 18 degrees Celsius. With that, though, the risk of possibly a heavy and thundery shower. As we move into Sunday, one or two patches of mist and fog perhaps to begin with. A fairly cloudy day on Sunday. There will be some brighter intervals at times, but also some patchy outbreaks of rain and one or two showers for Northern Ireland. Temperatures a little bit down on what we'll be looking at on Saturday. If we do get the sunshine, temperatures reaching a maximum of 13 degrees Celsius.